everyone, this is Trish and today I'm going to talk about the Crooks Fire, which is burning about 10 miles south of Prescott, Arizona. It started in an area known as Groom Creek. Now this fire started the day after Easter, so Easter Monday if you will. Prescott, Arizona has a highway system with about three major thoroughfares going through it. One of them is Highway 89, which I'm on right now. We are going through the Granite Dells. The other one is Highway 69, and then there's also Highway 89A. Right now I'm traveling toward Prescott. I think we're gonna be getting just a little bit closer here where we can see something. And so again, this is the Granite Dells, which is situated about um, six miles north of downtown Prescott. So we feel relatively safe where we are. And I'm making this video just kind of clarify where things are to help explain to uh, friends and family and our viewers and uh, folks back home. And what you will see here is where the firefighters are setting up camp. This is where they stayed the night and this has been set up here for a few days now. Okay, so you can see a lot of um, smoke from the fire coming from the south. Those are the Bradshaw Mountains. downtown Prescott. We'll see if we can see some more smoke. Now as with a lot of fires, it looks like it's a lot closer than it really is. Um, so far, as far as I know, no structures have been impacted. to turn onto Prescott Lakes Parkway. And again, I'm still on Prescott Lakes Parkway and I'm coming close to Highway 69. And you can see some more smoke right in front of us from that fire. Now I can't tell you how much it has grown. The last I heard it was at about 3,000 acres. And right now I'm crossing Highway 69 and I'm taking you to a shopping area that is the Prescott Gateway Mall. Road, and there are some houses in the Walker Road area that have been evacuated. Right now, this is Lee Boulevard, and again, this is the entrance to the ranch at Prescott. Senator Highway. So now we're going directly south. We didn't quite make it to the downtown area. 
but right now we're in a district where there are a lot of um, Victorian homes. <laughs> okay, so here we are on Mount Vernon Avenue, which will become Senator as I've mentioned. And this is a Victorian district, all these fine Victorian homes that have been refurbished. Probably starting back in the 1970s. A couple more modern ones tucked in here and there, probably some from the arts and crafts period.
a sign. There's a fire truck. I'm doing the same thing. Camp Sky Y. <laughs> All right, trying to keep it a little bit safe. I'm gonna point the car and the camera a little towards the fire again. section of Highway 89 and Prescott Lakes Parkway. And these folks who are turning left right here are going the same direction that we had gone earlier. We are approaching Watson Lake. I may have mentioned that to you earlier. The Watson Lake Park area is closed. But we're coming up to the traffic circle where the firefighters are camping for the night. This is basically their base camp. So we're getting close to that traffic circle again. You can see some of their equipment. And it looks like just about everybody is in the field. So at nighttime, this kind of becomes a mini city. They are using two different type of aircraft to fight the fire. Now the two different types of aircraft that they are using for this fire is they're using helicopters which carry water and they're using larger aircraft which carry the retardant. Fire. And if 
I have any information from my friends and family and our viewers, I will let you know. I'm also going to include some links in the description box and that will take you to some of the Facebook information that I've found and if there are any other videos that relate to this, I will certainly put the link in the description box as well.